Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles. So we have a lot of quests to do, and uh, right now we are on the Imperial Ceremony Offerings. Uh, so we need the Mist Radiant from Basin Cave and Satoral Marsh, Ocean Radiant from the area of Central Seal Island at Earth Sea, Imperial Radiant from the area of the Ceremony Hall and the High Antia Tomb, and the Snow Radiant from the area of the Sealed Tower at Avalok Mountain. So, let's go ahead and uh, get those. So we got one over here. That is not the buttons that I meant to uh, click, but whatever. We got a collectible here that we don't need, but we'll get anyway. I could try to start uh, using some of these to top off... Uh, um, everyone's opinions, I suppose. That could be a uh, decent uh, use of uh, use of them. Otherwise, they're mostly trade fodder kind of thing. And there really are a lot, so... I don't know how uh, really necessary it is. I like how we really do not care at all that we are just getting uh, completely and utterly soaked doing this. I mean, I would care. No mercy. Ricky can win by himself. This one's safe. Yeah, let's go ahead and just uh. There you go. Finally came in. Fall? You fell. Oh, goody, 17 whole XP. Oh, oh. Cracked Claw. Jimmy Cracked Claw. Alright, well, let's go grab this Blue Gear Shard. All right, Miss Radiant, that is now ours. Okay, I've been playing too many games with uh, too many different uh, uh, control schemes. All right, so we're done here for now. Um, let's go next to Aerith Sea, and I believe we're going to a Central Seal Island. Ah. There's a uh, There's Telethia around now. I got to get up there. Leave me alone, leave me alone. Don't don't come after me. Yeah, Prison Island is completely gone. Alright, there's the Ocean Radiant. And, uh, also... I did give some thought about going, like, rolling back quickly and trying to make sure that I got, uh, uh connections, because I never got a connection with, uh, with this kid, kind of thing. Um. But, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that is a thing that happened there. Um, alright. Let's go to area maps, or hit the wrong buttons. I empty a tomb. Hall of Spirits, Hall of Trials, Ceremony Hall. Something is going to open up the rest of this, and I don't know what it is. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think that's going to open up at some point. But I don't know if it's a side quest thing or if it's a story thing. That's part of the problem. really anything uh, going on here other than leaping to our doom all right next up Valak Mountain and we actually want to go to the sealed tower here Hark Chapel oh hey I enter your refugee. What is it? It must have been difficult to find us. This adventurer uh, brought us here. I didn't know about this place. I would have gotten lost out there uh, alone. Well, that's nice. Carol. Yes. Everyone's so tired. I'm still feeling all right, so I'm keeping watch over the entrance. Zane's got a lot on his plate at the moment, so it, it's the least I can do. Yes. You want to trade at a time like this? Sure, why not? He might have something interesting for me. Uh, I don't know if I... I probably don't have anything better than uh, Damage Heal 5. There. Nothing else there. Do have a heart to heart, but we need more affinity. Quest completed! You've collected all the Radiance. Return to Satoral to perform the ceremony. Alright. But first... Let's go ahead and talk to you. Monado used to be sealed away on this pedestal. Maybe none of this would have happened if the seal was stronger. No, that just means the Mechon would have destroyed us instead. Besides, all this has already been decided from the beginning. You have a quest. Are you that... You really got me out of a scrape last time. Do you know what's in the ruins the, on Three Sage Summit? Could you tell me more? Me and Dunman will hear you out. Yes, let's hear it. I didn't think so. Although I'm pretty sure you must have heard of the Giants, right? <laughs> yeah, you can say that. I heard that an immense power left by the Giants lies within the ruins. But the entrance is blocked by a sealed door. I got attacked by monsters while I was studying it last time, but I managed to find out how to open the door. I discovered that it's sealed by the mystical power of the Giants. To open it, you need the three treasures of the Giants. Heart of the Giants, Truth of the Giants, and Daring of the Giants. Now the me or Karalfa are interested in treasure. We just want to explore the ruins. How about it? Think you can find the treasures and open the door? Collect the three Giants treasures from all around the world. 88,000 monies, 175,000 XP. That's, uh, that's a lot. The final giant's ruins. Collect the giant's treasures and use them to unseal the door to the ruins on the Three Sage Summit. You'll accept that quest? I will accept that quest, Lolical. Alright, collect the truth of the giants. Collect the daring of the giants. Collect the heart of the giants. Collect the giant's treasures scattered around the world. You don't know where they are or who, is, who has them, but researchers may be a good place to start. Oh, I actually have Daring of the Giants and Heart of the Giants already. Convenient. I will also accept that quest. Then you'll do it. There are giant's ruins all over Bionis. You might be able to find the three treasures if you check them out. And good luck. Not a problem. Consider it done. That's right. Leave it to us. Hey. You came all the way here to look for us? Thanks, but I'm afraid all I can do is tell you where the others are. I only know of survivors at Bionis's leg and Aerith Sea. Hopefully that comes in useful. Th that doesn't actually. No, because you haven't told me uh, where in those places. Are you that? Go ahead and trade. Uh, Flash Shield Elphidar. Yeah, go ahead and go for this. 27 thou. Well, 
Thunder Atmos I can do. Rainbow Slug I can do. Frost Glass I can do. I kind of want to get a... Uh... No, alright. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, Frost Glass. Uh, I want to try and get a uh, Overtrade bonus. Well, maybe we shouldn't try with this item. We'll go with Thunder Atmos. Although those are not the easiest to get anymore. Are you that? I am that, yes. Climb gear, amethyst armor, spike five, blaze attack five. Amethyst vanilla and gypsum branch. Okay, so a lot easier to get an overtrade with this one. Let's get up to uh, Macro Passion. Let's see if that's enough. Nope. I may have also already done an overtrade. I don't I think you can only do once. Golden X Heart and Silver Lexos Heart. Alright, well. Oh, to be fair, I can also do uh, these. Um, element Chunks, I know I... Well, that's red. Okay, if this doesn't get an overtrade, then oh, I've already done it. Is this what I think it is? I suppose I better give you something in return. Well, take it then. A fire element. And you have one other. Are you that? Yeah, I have a lot of those. Alright. So those are the only two named people here. Alright, so... Uh, we need to go back to... Uh, Satoral Marsh. And as close as we can get to the Oath Sanctuary, which kinda is this. So I'm pretty sure the other two of those uh, um, giant things, like one of them was probably gotten from uh, out here, above the uh, uh, exile fortress thing. Not sure where the third one is. We'll find it eventually. Wonder if the expectation is that you'd have it by now, because uh, if so, I suppose it's a quest that I may have missed. I don't know. If these quests were numbered in here, like if this was uh, like it said Q one hundred thirty-four or something like that. That would at least allow me to, you know, and then they'd, they'd sort by the number. And we're getting close. Don't lose focus. Psychics, try hard. This one's mine. I don't have any healing. Oh, missed that. Uh, 
uh, before I chain attack, I want to do that. Okay, that's break. That is topple. Let's do a poison. Oh, missed it. Good job, it everyone. Oh, well, now he's dead. All right, quality horn. All right, so we were able to uh, take out uh, that guy now. We are getting close to a point where we can start taking some of these out. That guy is still uh, pretty high level, though, in comparison. And with all the other guys around, that would be... I might have to, like, try to lure them or something. And hope that doesn't, like, bring all of them against me. Wait, is this not where I'll go? Uh, skill links. All right, we got a uh, another level with Ricky. AP bonus, XP bonus. I don't know how many landmarks we're going to find. So we'll go with the AP uh, bonus. Increases tension after a successful uh, battle start affinity. Increases agility when hit points are at half. Reduces weight of equipment. That's always good. But we'll go with the, uh, the tension one. All right, so. Right, that is a different one. I think that was a secondary, um. Nope, not that. Nope. At the Satoral Statues, okay. That's over here. Ow. My feet. My mistake. I wish if you had marked a subquest, it would, like, uh, automatically mark the, like, go back to the, uh, the main quest. So you don't have to go, like, find it again. need to do some more uh, heart to hearts as well. But let's go ahead and uh, offer at the adulthood emblem. Oh goody! Radiant Terex. Oh god. Well... I have no way of taking out the, uh... Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna die here. We're, we're too low level and we do not have the right party for this. I, I appreciate the game uh, not giving me any kind of warning. A big door eight. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. All right. 
That is that is so little uh, damage that we have inflicted on him. Yeah, we are uh, we are almost not hitting at all. We've barely done any damage to him. I mean, encouraging do is uh, doing some healing, but <laughs> you're so dead. Got a, did get a critical hit. I can't move. Oh, miss that. Alright, what next? Uh, Big Gore 8 again. Yep, yep. There we go. Take the, uh... Of course, now this means that he's gonna die. Oh, actually, no. Yoink, item obtained. That's good. I really could try running. Not that that guy has any buffs, but you know, whatever. I'm not sure what the spike is, because it doesn't seem to be doing a whole lot of damage. Then again, we're not hitting, so... Getting some affinity changes. Constantly smashing uh, those, uh, those visions. Yep, there he goes. I will draw straight. Hit him hard next time. Nicely done. Doing okay on hit points, which uh, surprises me. I mean, we're doing like no damage at all. Alright, let's do that. That, so we get a guaranteed critical and then miss, you know. Oh, there goes, uh, Ricky. Well, unfortunately, I can't use heat haze. No, I'm, I am not hitting. Uh, what's going wrong is that, uh... Too low level <laughs> for it. There we go. All right. All right. So we don't do that one yet. We don't do that one yet. It's good to know. It's good to know. Okay. I guess in that case, uh, I know we can do this one. What is my map button again? That's my map. My map button. There we go. Okay, I think they're over there. They are indeed. Out that way. Alright, what is going to be the easiest way to get down there? Jumping down from this still broken uh, thing. All 
right, we'll go collect these up and then uh, head north. Hello, thank you. Floating dance apple. So flamies should be uh, reasonable enough for me to take care of. Flamies? I don't know. I mean, they're certainly not uh, secret of mana dragons, that's for sure. Alright, so we'll get up there, take care of one of them, and uh, end the episode after we get our item, I think. Because we've fought them already, so I'm not too worried about this being uh, a problem. So the positioning of this stuff makes me think that all of this is... Uh, um, is it Resplendent Flammies? No, it's not. Have we faced these guys yet? And another quality beat. Let's go. Let me at him. Psychics. Try hard. Oh, Ricky is uh losing tension because he was just water. Poison, nice. Good amount of chain damage. I guess that's one of the ways, that is definitely one of the ways to uh, get high chain damage, is uh, um, like get a lot of area of effect stuff. Uh, get out of the water, Ricky. I can't help you if you're in the water. Like, that's, that's up to you to get out of the water. Not bad. 
Alright, what do we get? Uh, Flamey Waterfall Orb, Rare Flamey Crystal, Hyrax Gloves. Flamey Waterfall Orb, Form of Spear, Eternity Knives, Asura Quises. Those might be two. Ancient Sardi Meat. Now we're a Flamey Crystal, a Z Attack Frame, a Flamey Waterfall Orb, and a Quality Beak. But we did not fight the uh, things that we need to to get the uh, particular items that we want. So let's continue heading over here. Flailing Bracken. I don't know if we've, uh, faced you. Well, I was hoping to, uh... Go water shot, huh? Dang it, missed him. Yeah, it feels like there's not quite the same. Oh, shoot, got toppled. I should have gotten a, uh... Oh, you're already broken, so that's good. Good days on you. Good. We'll go with, uh, where are Dang it. Missed it. Just get a, uh, uh, get a Gale Slash off, so let's go with, uh, break, get topple up. Not that much damage, unfortunately, but it is toppled. And it's dead. And there we go. Okay, what do we get? Uh, Azure Flamey Wing, Rare Flamey Crystal, Segment Drones. Uh, Flamey Waterfall Orb, Rare Flamey Crystal, Summon Earth that we already have learned. That's unfortunate. Eclipse Leggings. That's it. Alright. Well, I would kind of... I guess I don't really need... Really need uh, another one. Yeah, that's okay. All right, skill trees. All right, we got skill links with uh, Ryan. Excellent. All right, uh, nothing that we can learn. You can learn aggro bonus when no armor is equipped. Meh. Okay. 
Uh, what about equipment? We did get some new uh, drones. Segment drones. Sword Drones 2, and that is uh, extra physical defense and ether defense. Don't mind if I do. What do I, what do I currently have? Um, that is Sword Drones 2. And agility up 4. Alright, so what did we get? Uh, Idun Kowling. Okay, blue. What does that match? Maybe a speed cowling one. I don't think so. No, it would probably be a two. Might be attack cowling. Nah, probably not. No, because we got the uh, the attack cowling with that. Um, might be things that we don't have yet. Yeah. Might be things we don't have yet. All right. Oops. We did pick up some new weapons. I'm not sure what they were. Might have been the Eternity Knives. I don't know. That does have three slots. A little bit less uh, auto attack max. Um, better crit rate. Better auto attack min. And three slots. I will give it some thought. I'll give it some thought. Three slots is pretty good. Anyway, that is uh, it for that quest. So we need to go turn that in, and then uh, figuring, and then we'll figure out. Uh, what to do afterwards. Still a little bit too low level, so I want to, like, knock out as many of the, uh, um, the quests as I can, uh, that don't require us to fight powerful monsters to get more levels, if we can. That's the hope. Uh, we'll see how that goes. But that will be for next time. See you then, everyone.